Hey guys and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna do oh, a very hot pink, pink, very pink look. Hence why I'm wearing a pink shirt today. What the heck is that? But anyways, look, I found clips and I clicked the clip blah, blah, blah. what? And I clipped them on my head. One, two, three. I had a fourth one right here and I don't know what happened to it. But anyways, yes. Um, I'm going to be using my new favorite palette of all time. The Conspiracy Palette. Because I love this palette. And because I want Trish uh, this color all over my eyelids. All over my eyelids. So, oh, oh, wait, wait, guys. Before I get started, where'd it go? Uh-huh. Look what I bought today. Also why I was inspired to do pink look today because I have pink brushes, I have a pink bag, I have a pink shirt, okay? It's all pink, it's meant to be. Um, I got the, I already used some of these so some of them are dirty but I got this set from Jeffrey Estrella and they look like this and they're freaking cute. And I love them. So it's going to be a very, very pink look. And I'm going to go ahead and get started. I'm, oh, I wonder what kind of, I'm going to go ahead and use this one. This one's a JS8. It just looks like this. It's a very thick, fluffy brush. Going into my pills, which is, oh, which is this one right here. It's like a very, very light, like pink sort of color. I'm gonna grab that and I already primed my eyelids. I put concealer all over my eyelids and I'm just gonna go ahead and tap this everywhere to set it. So this is gonna be my base. Oh my nose is itchy. Yeah I was like looking at donuts because I'm fat and I honestly like got inspired by sprinkles and donuts because and I'm probably gonna draw like donuts as uh, freckles just cuz right after I'm done with all this I don't know if I'm gonna record that so I'm probably just gonna like do that all off camera because it's probably gonna take me a while to get all the little donuts on there and I'm probably gonna mess it up, so we'll find out at the end of this video. So what I'm doing right now is I'm literally just setting my concealer with this um, shade. And then I'm gonna, guys, now you wanna grab another brush. This is a uh, JS5, and it's a little bit dirty, but it's okay. It just has a little bit of brown in it. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and grab my pigment, which is uh, that very pink shade. And whoa, it is a dust. And I'm gently gonna just pat that on where I'm gonna create the shape that I want first with this color. So, and then I'm gonna just blend it out. So basically, I'm just putting this color in my crease or right slightly above my crease and blending it out all the way. Ugh, I got powder in my eye. go back in and just grab that color on the tip and then simply simply apply that right in my crease area Okay, 
Okay, now I'm gonna grab another brush. I'm gonna grab this one. This one is the JS11. It's kind of like a flat packing brush. So I'm gonna use, I'm gonna grab Trisha with that color. Ooh, okay, look at that. And apply that all over my eyelid, starting off with this one. I'm going to actually spray the brush with setting spray and see if that works better. Because I know some of the shades, sometimes the brush, um, it's not the shadow, it's not the pigment, it's the brush. Some brushes don't go with certain shadows. Um, what am I looking for? Well, okay, let's stick to the theme. I'm going to use my Jeffree Star. This one's brand new. That was a lot, okay. I'm gonna go ahead and just pack that on there. I'm probably gonna try with my finger. I'm gonna try with my finger on the other eye, see what I like better. Ooh, okay, yeah. This is, oh no, that fallout. I mean, it looked nice with the um, with the setting spray, but I want it to be more hot pink. Like, I want this to be a very pink look. Now, doing it with my finger is causing fallout, which is okay, because I'm just planning to put a lot of blush right after this. But I don't want to, like, ruin it. So, now I'm just kind of blending it smudging it with my finger to blend it out and then I'm gonna go back in with the brush and the setting spray right after to make it look more nice but this is just to kind of blend it out with your finger see that Ooh, so bubble gummy I'm gonna grab a fluffy brush. Oh, let's see what other brush I can use from this palette. Probably gonna go in. I'm going with this one. This is the JS. I'm good. I was gonna say Morphe. It is from Morphe, but uh, JS12, which is very small, like blending brush. And I'm going to go into pigment again. And then just blend it out. I'm going to use like big circular motions here to just like blend it all the way up.
and then using the this one, the JS8, and then with nothing on it, it just is blending that back and forth, back and forth. Like a windshield. Beep, 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 beep. That's not the noise that a windshield makes, but okay. I'm really dragging it to like my brow bone. That's how high I'm doing this. I kind of want to, should I add like sprinkles? I don't know. To make it look like a donut? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I kind of want to add more sparkle like in the middle. So I'm going to go into my these big girl and grab, oh, she darling, wet jewel, which is that, um, oh, wait, let me do it this way, which is this one right here. It's like a very pink shimmery. Okay, wow, guys, like, look at this. Okay, wait, so let me just, like, show you guys real quick. Do it this way. See how beautiful that shimmer just, like, made it look? I know. If I'm, like, focused on camera, I can't see, but that is freaking cute. Now that we're looking like a pink madness, I am gonna do what else can I do pink eyeliner I think so y'all I really love these okay this was the best deal I got from Amazon and I just went like super white what happened oh sorry sorry guys sorry um but yeah anyways these really do not come off which is kind of crazy oh I kind of love this oh <gasps> Oh, should I do like a, oh, that'd be so cute, wouldn't it? This as an eyeliner, or should I stick to the whole full pink look? Nah, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this color. Um, okay, actually, I'm gonna go ahead and do this off camera, and then I will be back, and hopefully I will have donut freckles. But we will see how that happens, how that, we will see how that works out. Play. and I'm back like two hours later <laughs> you guys my donuts <laughs> they're, not, they're sad donuts these are these are sad looking donuts but overall I think it's cute I look delicious delicious um I went ahead and just finished off of my eyelashes the lower lash line um I ended up putting pigment a little bit of pigment and not a fact which is like the pink and then like a burgundy shade just to kind of darken it up a little bit for lips i'm using this new lipstick that i got from ipsy which is let me show you because it's so tiny um by girl power i love this name by the way they'll focus and this is the shade deep mauve which is this Cute. Look at it, tiny and cute. Whoa, okay. You tiny. Um, I put that, and then I, a little bit, I kind of made it a little bit of an ombre, ombre using um, the Jeffree Star Velour lipstick in the shade Christmas Cookie. And of course, I had to make it sparkly, so I added some gloss, some sparkly gloss, and that is what it's looking like. I have mocos. Don't look at my nose, okay? Um, and. I attempted to do donuts and then I added sprinkles to the side. I mean, from far away, it looks like a freaking, um, whatchamacallit, Snapchat filter. So we'll just deal with that. And I put my little clips, I put my hair down too. Um, I don't know what the stain on my shirt is and it's bugging me. But yeah, I put blush, like a lot of blush. And uh, the blush I was using was, I mean, I don't know if you guys care, but I'll show you anyways this one by Oprah it is in the shade I think it's called all you needed love which is really cute and then 
it's like it's like peach pinky kind of tone and i put that like everywhere and that is it that's the finished look this is my sad looking donuts look at my peach first you could see it on the camera oh gosh but that's it i hope you guys uh enjoyed this video i sure did i mean i know you guys didn't see the struggle but i struggled just, just thought i had to put that out there you know so. um but yeah and the lashes that i'm using are by um xoxo leo lashes these are the sh the shade what the heck these are in the style lady leo and they're super gorgeous and long and wispy and i love them and if you don't if you haven't seen my other videos where I tell you that, go follow them on Instagram because they are amazing. I know the person who does the lashes and she is an amazing person. Beautiful as well. Just know that I love you. And then, yeah, go show some support. Plus, her eyelashes are bomb. Why not? But, yeah, that is the video for today. I tried to do a donut filter. That wasn't really my attempt, but that's what happened. And bye. Remember when people used to do this? Like, my old.